Hi, I'm Paul Atoll from PaulAtoll.com and I'm going to show tonight um, a video tutorial about um, uh, Knights and Merchants uh, the remake. Um, so first of all, it's one website with all kind of cool stuff, lots of games, DOS, Amiga, Mystic games, but especially Windows games. And I'm going to focus at the moment on the, the specific game Knights and Merchants the remake. Um, well, you can find uh, Knights and Merchants uh, game page using uh, the game page link. And then go to strategy, and you will find um, the game uh, up here. Nice merchants. I've got over uh, 900 game ports, so feel free to check out uh, all the other games as well. Mm, you see here two downloads: download uh, of the original wrapper for original game, and uh, remake. Um, you will think perhaps, hey, why not one wrapper instead of two? Well, both game needs their own engine. So, um, yeah. So if you play the original game, use this wrapper. If you play the remake, use this wrapper. All right. Um, well, let's focus on um, on the game. Um, download first the um, the wrapper. You can find uh, uh, here. So click on the link. And you can download the file click OK um, then uh, you need the game itself because the remake won't work without the original game uh, because of le legal reasons especially so you can uh, buy the game uh, from uh, gg.com just can click on the link on, uh, on the site you'll get here if you don't have an account yet create an account um, and then um, you can download the game as you can see I already own it it's only 5.99, so um, well, support uh, the developers and uh, buy the game, download it, uh, and then um, um, you have the original game. Then you also need a remake of the game, so you can click on this link. You go to the remake website. This awesome guys, uh, um, well, created this amazing remake. Uh, you can download the file from uh, the download tab and um, you can download the full install of file from here choose your mirror download it and um, yeah after download uh, that file you'll have in total um, well three files uh, the zip file the two installer files extract this uh, cam remake file and you will got get this wrapper, wrapper thingy and then you have those two files double click it click on install windows software choose executable go to uh, your uh, your well, place where you have those two files first install knights and merchants from gog that's the original game and we would do that straight away after the installation don't click launch yet just click on uh, Click on Exit Installer. Exit this one because this wrapper isn't meant for the original game. It's only for the remake. So click on Install Software again. Choose Setup. Go back to the place where you have also the the remake file downloaded. Oops. Um, where did I put it in here? And install the remake. If you um, only install the remake, it will say in the wrapper that uh, the um, uh, the original game isn't installed. So you need the original game, also for legal reasons, uh, installed before installing the um, the remake. Well, this remake will be installed and I can say in advance that the game itself, the, f the single player, the campaigns and all that stuff works amazing. So you will have your fun with it completely. However, multiplayer is a bit more an issue. And I will show you in a second. And that's not that you can play it because of the game. No, it's because of the ping. And no, it's it's not your 
router or it's my router no it's something in wine which well makes you have a higher ping than normal so okay this is installed then uh, um, that's not good this this is not mini because it's the original one we have to uh, set the installer up in the remake one um, it's in here GG is the cam remake and put the cam remake choose all right this should be it all right double click it and you will see that uh, the remake will launch I won't play it full screen now at the moment, but you can put it to uh, to full screen, and then um, well, and then it will go full screen. If I go full screen now, um, you see white bars on the side because of screen flow. It's the program I used to capture this video, so that's why I won't do it right now. Uh, otherwise, you will always see the mouse doing weird uh, while it's doing, of course, fine, but the screen capturing doesn't show it correctly so that's why I will use um, um, for this video um, uh, only window mode but you can play it f uh, full screen without any problems okay let's show you what you will see um, what I mean about um, uh, the, the ping so I go to a lobby uh, join uh, lobby and you will see that my ping, where's my no name ping? Well, it's here. Huh. Quite doable, by the way. Uh, <laughs> Alrighty. Okay. Looks like this pink thing is only when you are a full screen. So if you are in, um, window mode the, the the ping seems to be okay well I haven't that well still have quite a dual ping here so multiplayer play in window mode if you play um, sing um, single player campaign you can play it in full screen well this is the first time I tested and I keep quite a doable ping oh sh uh, all right ready darn why I'm kicked well Probably on a oh my ping is starting to get higher again yeah okay so multiplayer um, I suggest to um, to do only with two players or something try that try that all right um uh, back to menu. Let's show you the um, uh, campaign. Uh, start campaign. So, single player, I would play in. Uh, I would play in uh, full screen, of course. 
but I will only show um, So, um... yourself. Um, quit mission, quit mission. Yeah. So, as you can see, it works awesome for uh, for single player at least. Uh, multiplayer, it's um, yeah suggested to uh, to try multiplayer against only two players, and um, yeah, for Mac users, you can try that. Um, yeah, well, anyway, um, have fun with the game, uh, spread the word, and see you back on Portal.com. Uh, if you love the work I do, you can always donate to my website and support my hard work. And uh, yeah, uh, spread the word, and um, see you back on Portal.com. Bye-bye.